Hey, what's up guys? So today we're going to talk about a brand new game that I just found out probably a couple hours ago. Uh, this game is called Bomb Crypto. It's the same game you see on the screen right now. Basically, it's like Bomberman when you play. I'm not sure if you guys played 8-bit Bomberman before, but um, I grew up with this game when I was a lot younger. But the only difference here is that the characters play themselves. They require energy to play and they will earn you B coins. So what is B coins? B coins is basically the bomber coin or I think it's called bomber coin and it allows you to um, buy characters with it. It allows you to upgrade your characters in it or you need to have bomber coins to upgrade your characters as well. So over here, oh it's not loading but I do have some B coins earlier from a previous recording but the audio screwed up that's why we are doing it again. But nonetheless, um, I'll just bring you through the white paper really quickly. Uh, you can go to bombcrypto.io. You can take a look at the white paper here. So something interesting is that you're able to just um, you know, go on with the game. You can buy some heroes and I'm going to buy a few more heroes later on and I'll show you how it's going to be done. Okay, so you can get a few heroes here um, and they have different rankings. They go from common to rare to super rare and legendary and uh, I think there's also super legendary heroes as well. And there are a few ways you can get heroes. Number one is if you're playing the game already, you will have a chest like this. That will allow, And once you break this chest, you're able to get um, new heroes um, because you rescue a hero basically. And the other way to do it is to um, buy the heroes with B coin. Or, or bomb bomb coin if i'm not wrong is it called boomer coin yes so you can either buy it here um so they do have an auction function as well but this function is not up yet the auction is still in the pipeline but hopefully with the auction we are able to sell some of these nfts for um you know you can flip your nfts here or you can buy better nfts to farm uh, faster in the game for more b coins which can be sold uh, for other cryptocurrencies that you already want or cryptocurrencies that you that you want to accumulate as well so let's talk about house now so the houses actually allows your characters to rest and while they are resting they regain energy that will enable them um, to farm for more b coins while after they are well rested like you know you work so hard in a day and when you get a break you want some tequila and then that is where you go into a house so there's like 5,000 houses available right now, if I'm not wrong. But um, it's pretty expensive. I think for the smallest house, it's 720 B coins right now. And with the price of B coins, so um, that's like 720 B coins, which is about 9.2 BNB. Or if you put it into um, US dollars, that's about $5,000 right here, just for the house. But the houses price do fluctuate and there are not many houses left so um you know you guys if you guys are jumping in um houses are good but they do come at a price as well so just take note of that all right so the next thing we have is how to upgrade our characters uh, definitely like any other game the higher level your characters are the more b coins they are able to farm and the faster they're able to farm those b coins as well so to upgrade characters you will require two things the first thing you need is to have the same a character of the same level and the second thing that you need is to have uh, B coins as well so to upgrade a character you need both B coins and another character so it will in a way burn that, that spare character so it's a bit like the Mobile Legends um, chess game where you are able to um, you know merge two two star heroes together to form a, a three star hero something on that line uh, I think this works pretty much the same so let's look at the token allocation uh they do have quite a bit um spread out which i think is pretty all right the only worrying thing is that the team has 25 percent of the tokens uh but this is locked over a year so it will be linearly uh, released over the period of one year so um this is not something for you to worry about because this means that the, the founders or the team do not have the tokens on hand and they are only given tokens um as they as the as time progresses and they will be given a small amount of token every month or every day depending on what the the lock um, clauses are 
So something I saw is that they had they do have a staking reward, which is something I personally like. I think this is something that you can consider as well. If Bcoin um allows you to do some staking, I think that will be very 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 interesting. So if you guys don't know, um I'm into staking and I really love staking a lot because it's a very very good way to get passive income without doing much. All you have to do is just to own the tokens. All right, so uh, roadmap. I think all these are pretty straightforward. If you guys want to uh, read them up, I will put the link in the description down below where you guys can read up on that. So let's talk about the game itself. Um, there are a few things that you require to actually start the game. So the first thing is MetaMask. If you guys don't already have MetaMask, I will put the link in the description as well, where I covered um, VVS Finance, and that. In that video, I also showed how to set up a MetaMask, how to get it linked to a certain network. Uh, so for this game, you will need to link to BSC or the Binance Smart Chain. So this game runs on Binance Smart Chain, which means that you will require BNB tokens to do your transactions as well. So before you transfer um, BNB into your wallet, make sure you do some calculation that you have enough BNB to continue playing this game because every time you do a transaction, there is a cost and there's a fee involved too. Okay, so um, this is the game platform, this is like, or the game console, um, whatever you guys want to call it. So there's a shop here where you can buy um, your hero. So plus one hero is 10 coins. You can buy um, five heroes for 50 coins and 100 for 10 heroes. And then you can also buy land. Uh, I won't say it's land, but it's a house where this allows you to recharge your characters faster. The more, um, the, the higher the charge rate, the faster your heroes are able to farm for more tokens or b coins in that sense so uh, pretty simple logic here you have house you can, you can you can go faster and there's a limited supply of houses as well so i'm assuming that if if the auction do happens um, houses might be in demand because people want to have energies a lot faster which will allow them to farm more b coins in the future all right so um oh so this is how the map looks like anyways um i don't have any heroes now that's why it's not moving around but nonetheless, um, we're just gonna go buy some heroes now. So we have, um, we need 10 tokens, 10 B coins to buy one hero. So we're just gonna go pancake swap. Um, I'm gonna buy like 100 coins. So that will be, um, we can buy 10, 10 Bombermen, 10 heroes, 10, yeah. Just 10 characters for a start. All right, so we're just gonna confirm swap. Uh, this game is not cheap guys, but I think it's a lot cheaper than um, Axie Infinity. If you ask me, I think it's a lot, lot cheaper than Axie Infinity. Anyways, Axie prices are dropping, so could be something you guys want to look at as well. Okay, so we just got to wait for the thing to come through. In the meantime, we just stare at this beautiful wallpaper. Okay, so on BSC scan, it says um, confirm. All right, so let's just check our MetaMask real quick. There we go, 100 B coins. So we're just gonna go back to the game. We're gonna buy 100 heroes now. Not enough B coins. Are you kidding me, bruh? Okay, let's try that again. Hmm. It's okay, we'll just refresh the page and see what happens. Okay, so we're gonna go shop, we're gonna buy 10. There we go, minting in progress. So once you have BNB in your account, um, all MetaMask, like mine is in MetaMask right here, so I have about 0.9 BNB. Uh, what you need to do is to get some uh, B coin. So to get B coin, you will have to go through PancakeSwap, which is a decentralized exchange to get your B coin. So let's search B coin here. Okay, so before this video, um, as I was recording the previous video, I know that each um, 
each heroes requires um, 10 B coin to mint and I already have 10 and I'm gonna get 5 more. So the reason I'm getting 15 is because in the map itself, every single map, you are only able to have 15 active heroes constantly um, playing the game and getting B coins for you. If you have additional heroes, those heroes will be put to rest. So um, if you are starting on a budget, I think 15 is like the meta here, but you don't need to have 15, you can start with 10, you can start with 5, but the only back, uh, the only drawback is that it's going to take you a longer time to ROI, and I think that the name of such NFT games are to ROI as fast as possible. Once you get back your return of investment, and then you can decide on whether you should invest more into the game, or whether you should invest into other projects. So we're just going to swap um, for another 50 tokens here. So 15, 50 tokens here will cost me about 0.64 BNB. We just swap. Okay, so since I uh, just got to wait for the transaction. Alright, so we are back and the transaction is done. So you can see I got 50 B coin here. So what we need to do next is to go to the game. So um, you can go to bomb crypto. Bomb crypto.io. We're gonna click play now. Uh, we just wait for the game to load. So um, as I was recording the video, I was trying a few times to log into the game, but I think there is some problem with the server right now bad luck otherwise we could open a few heroes and i could give you some explanation on how the game runs but looks like the game's down alrighty so we're back um this is the future jordan that is speaking now uh just now the server went down a little bit so with new projects like that sometimes uh you, you do expect things like this to happen um you don't have to be afraid it's a rug pull but it could potentially be um no one really knows right so um, we bought um, 50 B coins, which you can see it's down here. And what we're going to do is to purchase new heroes now. So we're just going to go to shop. Uh, this is where you can either buy house or you can buy a hero. So to buy houses, so like the tiny one here costs uh, 720, like um, past Jordan has mentioned, this allows you to rest four heroes there and then it scales up from there. So, um, you know, if you're looking to buy one, you could just buy, you need 720 tokens, uh, B coin to buy uh, a single house that will allow you to house four heroes that you can rotate, um, so that they can continuously farm or mine B coins for you. So we're going to buy five heroes here. We're just going to mint it right now. Uh, all right. So we're just going to confirm this. So, um, as mentioned before, um, everything is done in B and B, so make sure that you do have enough B and B so that you can do all these transactions. So right now it's just um, waiting, waiting, and waiting. Oh no! So we have an unknown error now. Um, no idea what's gonna happen because my transaction was sent into the blockchain uh, let's see let's see yep so bad news guys um, I tried um, but I think yep so we are not gonna get any mints now but um, yep so the transaction was already done um, and the hero I think I'll probably do a hero review on a, on a YouTube shots or something like that I think that would be a bit helpful to you guys to see what's the percentage although it's all available on the simulator that past jordan will cover uh, right after this uh thank you guys so much for watching uh, do support past jordan he's coming right after this so over here you're able to see this is the stimulator simulator not stimulator okay but over here you're able to see um this is where you can s simulate how much you can potentially earn here so I've added uh, my first 10 heroes earlier today and based on each hero they are able to earn a max profit of this amount of B coins and the minimum is here and how much time they need to rest to get full energy again. So I do have heroes who have a little bit more 
like one of my heroes which is a super rare uh, this guy requires 13 hours to regain back all the energy that it, that it has expended and like the common ones takes a little bit lesser like 5 hours I have this guy here that takes a lot lesser than 5 hours uh, let me find it uh, I think it's this one I do have a little doge character that takes like a lot lesser to to um, you know recover energy that allows it to um, farm faster and faster uh, f farm faster with lesser rest time but each character has a maximum profit and a minimum profit this is always just a gauge um, do not take it as financial advice and you can switch it to team stats so I'm looking to earn like 45 USD worth of B coins and it's not 45 USD but $45 USD worth of B coins um, every single day and why it has a frequency of one hour visits is because you need to um, make sure that your your characters are working all the time because sometimes they might be in rest when they could actually be working so I'm still pretty new to the game I haven't really tested out whether this could just auto run by itself but I will update you guys again um, if that is possible but the game's not loading so it's kind of sad alright so since the game is not loading I've tried it multiple times looks like we have to do the buy on another video uh, but nonetheless uh, if you feel that this video has given you some insights about the game and if you guys want to join I'll leave a link all in the description down below um, do drop a like subscribe and I'll see you in the next one